is brush fire season, and you may not know it, but your backyard could potentially turn a small fire into a very large one quickly. Tucson Fire Captain Barrett Baker has more on what you can do to keep your home and the surrounding areas safe from a blaze. Now it's brush fire season, and that means it's important that we have a defensible space around your house. And who better than our lineman from U of A to talk about defensible space and making a little pocket. Now normally it's with the quarterback, but today it's your house. Now we want to keep fire out of the pocket, and there are plenty of ways to do that. Your hands can snap weeds all day long, as our center, Carter Wood, knows best. Tools like hoes, rakes, or shovels can also help in the trenches, as Jacob and Levi show us. But one thing that will earn a personal foul and ejection is the blowtorch. Never burn weeds with a torch because too many times it's more than weeds that burn. So Alex and Zach are driving that idea right off the field. Now cutting down defenders can spring the big one and put six on the board. But not cutting down low-hanging branches can spring the big one, too. A big fire, that is. Fire can easily travel up from weeds to bushes to trees to houses. So while a cut block is good, a cut limb is even better. Now our offense can be quick strike and move downfield in a flash. Jones from Solomon, touchdown Caleb Jones. But the same goes for brush fires, especially on windy days. Having combustible things close to the house, like dumpsters or even wood piles, is the equivalent of an illegal procedure. Fire is always looking to spread quickly, but you can stop it before it gets going by driving these things away. Now, you don't get to be this big unless you do a lot of power cleans and a lot of hanging cleans. But today, we did a little bit of yard cleaning. And why is that important? Because defensible space. Now, as firefighters and wildcats, we're not very fond of things related to sparks. Whoops. So remember the little things. And from your Arizona Wildcats and your Tucson Fire Department, bear down and stay safe. <laughs> you would do that. That was good. We love it. Thank mm -hmm. you very much. He always makes those so interesting. He really does. And today is one of those days, as he just mentioned, mm -hmm. windy. Some really good advice from mm -hmm. him, especially with these wind gusts. Top